Hey everyone, and welcome to another Draw With Me video. If you don't already know me, hi, I am Candy, and I am live on Twitch every Tuesday, Thursday, and Sunday. And this is where I generally like to do a lot of Draw With Me's and things like that. So uh, this week I ended up doing a witch, and then I end up uh, editing the video and putting it more in a condensed version for everyone on YouTube to enjoy. So I just wanted to take this moment to also tell you a little bit about myself. I work full time as a lead layout artist working on a fantastical show called uh, The Muppet Babies and I wanted to pursue more of my artistic drawing sensibilities with my iPad because my day job I'm mostly doing uh, 3D work and editing so I wanted to uh, focus more on my personal growth and that's where this YouTube channel and my Twitch comes in. Now uh, a really fun thing I've been doing lately is I'm taking backgrounds that are in animated movies and also clips from feature length films and I am doing a analysis with you guys live on Twitch where we actually dive into why these pieces of art are either good or bad and I talk about why and the choices that were made by the people that made it. So I really hope you guys will check out my content there three times a week and I also have a discord if you didn't know already you can find out more about all of this down below but um, I would love to know from you guys what type of content you'd like to see more on YouTube like these draw with me's and things like that uh, this was a little bit different of a draw with me because you have the overhead with seeing me draw and then also the uh, just the image on screen. So I'd love to know what type of video you like. Do you like to see my hand and screen and then flip back to the other type of view or not? I'm kind of impartial. This way does take a little bit longer to edit, but it's really no skin off my back. I'm just looking for more creative, like-minded people that want to learn and just, you know, see where the art takes you. So, uh, I guess I should talk about what I'm doing in the video, huh? Um, <laughs> so I did a rough underlay uh, with a gesture, and I love doing a gesture because it really gives the movement into what it is that you're trying to represent. Then from there, I like to do a clean outline, and I always like to change my outline color. I don't always do it, but I like to change my outline color to a darker version of the inside color that I'm going to be coloring my character just because I think it adds a little bit of a pop. And sometimes I do it with just the outline first color and then my fill color. Sometimes I do it the opposite way. I don't really have a set way of how I do these things yet, but uh, as of right now, I'm just adding in all of my base fill color after doing my outline color. And uh, I wanted, I'm, I'm very much so into blue blues and purples and just any of the greens and stuff like that. It's just, they're yummy to me. I really love pastels and these types of colors, so I tend to favor them more than others. So I also added in a little Navi character um, props to anybody that loves Zelda. <laughs> and now I'm going in and adding in some darks. Now, actually, fun fact, I have taken a tutorial and I don't, and I do things slightly differently than how I am showcasing it on this, but it, it doesn't change the fact that there's still valid things to learn from what I'm doing here. I also have a particular type of brush on my Procreate tablet that I absolutely love. It's a watercolor color brush and I absolutely love it for doing shadows and stuff like that because it, it just adds this extra textury kind of look. You can kind of see it right now with what's going on. So then after that I ended up going in and added in some highlights just here and there and then I was I was debating honestly I was really debating leaving her hair just the color that it just a flat but then I'm like eh if I added you know some darks and lights everywhere else I probably should add this in here. But yeah I hope you enjoyed enjoyed this content don't forget to check me out on twitch if you guys want to dive deeper into analysis and just hang out with some crafty like-minded people then come check out the discord and twitch anyways see you later guys bye